Hi, welcome back to a new part of our tutorial series to build an e-bike. Um, today we have one of the hardest things to do that you can imagine. That is to bring this uh, metal strings here on this plate and it must fit completely correct. And that is a monster. So we try it. Shift D to make a duplicate. N. And I give you here screencast keys. We take at first this here, that is for the back the wheel, and we have here two, the front and the back, and uh, both are different. Uh, this one is greater than the other one, so we must delete the back system completely. So for that, be careful that you only mark with L. You can mark uh, single objects, such like that, and that, and that, and so you mark all and at the behind there. Oh, that not that we need. Uh, only that parts here. Oh, that not. So control set go back. Then that here we don't need that not that not. Oh, wrong again. So X delete. Here is more. So we only have now the front and you see there are the rests where the other spikes normally come. So and now comes the horror to this. We must plug in that here. And then I think we see it better with the solid mode. Yeah. So that is the conquest. We must get these spikes into these holes. So we scale the whole spikes there and bring them to a size that it can fit. Such like that. Then we bring it into, you see, that comes in through the hole. Good. And all the rest we must tweak. There are many, many, many things to do and will real complicate it uh, because we don't want to destroy the topology of the, of the whole thing. So how we start that? The only way to do such is um, with a proportional editing tool. So we take here proportional editing connected. Now, first we try all this that comes from this side here. So I must look that is all complicated. So we take here this part and want to plug them there in. I think so it must be I'm not sure or must it be free? There comes that I think and there comes that yeah. Okay. So we grab that. Wow we why we have two that is not normal. There are two. So I take that and delete that. And then I'll try again with that one here. Grabbing and positioning in that hole. So we got that. This one here must be in that hole. So we get this one and grab. Oh, why that goes with? Ah, here's some marked. So we take that and grab and grab that in position, but without that shit there. So <laughs> we want to fuck off here. So grabbing and positioning, bang, that is it. Good. Go back to solid mode. That is in, that is in. So now 
I think this one must come there. So we take that one. And position them there. Hope that is all right. And this one here, I think, comes here. So we grab to that position. Wow, that is not really simple. And here, that one, grabbing and putting them there. This one, with circle selection, grabbing, positioning. And that here, too. So, then that here. Uh, but uh, I think that was not the last time we tweak around with that um, because there are the other ends of them they must fit with the with the rest so that will be interesting what we do here to get that all right but there is no other way so now we have the chaos high here, here. Don't know where or what I think that one should be there. That should be there. That seems like that is double there or something like that. Grab them there, and this one there. So, let me look what we got. Here are double strings, I see that. So, we get that one here, what else? And delete them. I think we have more doubles here than we think and that is why we have there such double things there but we will see in a moment that is okay so we look here and they come through that is wonderful here but we see when we look from the top that the most are not really at the back so we have to do that so we have to grab them only them so we just mark here all that we don't want to move okay then we bring them by grabbing back to yes and then two grab and y good same for all the rest there oh my god I hate this shit good but we must do it so close the mouth and make it here. Yeah. Okay. There are some I've forgotten, I know, but I must look what is that and that we need to bring in these two. Okay. So there are these two. Okay, so we'll set in the wireframe mode, circle selection, but only this one, grab Y, 
and bring higher same with that grab y bring higher so I think this one is ready go out there ah okay This makes no sense. I think we've forgotten one hole or so, but nobody sees that later, so we let it like it is. So that was the, was the first part. So the second part is the same with a smaller inner life there. So we keep it simple and um, make here a shift D copy of that and then we join them together as one. So we got that. Then we make here a middle loop in, scale them up but without proportional editing. Then control B to bevel and then we have here this round look that makes it a little bit smoother so smooth that all good uh, then this guys we don't need they are from the other side and that the other side must rotate it that we come to this point so with shift D make a copy of them then we apply first the rotation and the scale of the object then object mirror interactive mirror hold middle mouse button move the mouse and accept the left click now we have them in the same direction as you see and we need to rotate them so we rotate in the Y that becomes to that spike stair. So rotate Y and then in the middle of them. Think that must be it. Yeah, looks good. So now we need here the loses things here they are not fixed with some L L L oh that was two Good, we delete that. Oh, we've forgotten one. Okay. Good. I think we got that. Now we take it from the front. There we have the same uh, noobs there. And they we must delete. So we click them with L select them. So last good X delete. There is one double, so X delete. Good. So we have now our wheel ready, and as I said before, this one is smaller than the other one. So we must make them smaller in the middle and all should come with us i will hope so uh, so we take a circle selection such like that wow 
but we delete here this uh, select all that is not needed with background here no, that is important so now we want to small them down so we scale them simply but with proportional editing and then we can make it so that is a little bit smaller and we have the original other stuff good that is perfectly so we can take one for the front wheel because there we need smaller ones and this two guys we can now bring together you can see it from the top and we are at the right point Good. I think that was it. Here we see we have some <laughs> mystery things there. Uh, that we can delete the middle point and make one to the other end directly connection. Then that is a straight one. That is not the problem. The real problem is. Yeah, only that things you know hopefully what I mean when we delete here this words between oh, I will show you it one time With control plus you can select more than one so then we delete the words and now we can oh that was one too much yeah, must go one back, delete them. Then we can go from that point directly to the last point here. Space, search, and we take bridge, add sloop, and then we have a straight line. So you can clean up the, the lines where a little bit banded or some if you want. I don't do it. So um, that here we can plug away. That was the old first start. We take this here and join them together as one. And so we have here our back wheel. Uh, it must be not completely at uh, the white one. I go here and delete the last two I see there are. Okay. We need here a silver line where the brakes can uh, br uh, slow down the bicycle. So I mean there is uh, here this silver stuff there and then comes a black one and there comes the spikes and so here this uh, metallic one we now build so we take here 3d cursor and then add mesh circle rotate x90 scale down and it should be uh, not completely down there because it isn't there so we scale it a little that it is in the middle of the white one see it here is in the middle of them and then we extrude them to the Y then we get all in all and extrude scale down and that is our silver ring that we bring in top view set wireframe mode then you can make it exactly in the middle so we got that and this ring we make uh, silver so we give them your material silver rough 
and we see that it's not bright enough so scale Y to bring it out of the gummy and we see it is not uh, deep enough in the wheel so we scale them more so we have that yeah that looks much better and we should smooth it that's sure and so we have that with an add split on it it will look sharper and that is good for now then I told you we need this black thing where the spikes come in there so that um, thing is a little bit freaky stuff but we make it I take here this ring with shift D and then P and then I say separate that selection and now I have a single uh, circle there here is a single circle and that I can take as a basic material for the thing that we now want to build it must be a black plastic one and it must be um, smaller uh, in the down part so when we take that here and extrude scale that and then scale them in the Y then we got that black plastic thing that we need good so we give them here a minus and here a black plastic so we take black metal black gummy black plastic so there comes the spikes and so we bring that in the middle too so you can see it here at the point or make it with set that is better to see it absolutely that is correct good so we have done that that is fine the wheel is finished that is our complete wheel now the only thing what I see what we must make is between the silver and the white must be a black one so we take here this loop and this loop and make them with black gummy rough mm -hmm. we must wait he is a little bit in working stress I think we go back and take here another one and we take black plastic it's also good to sign good done good important now safe before you crash so give them version 13 save the plan file so we have done one wheel and uh, we need only the front wheel and as I said before that is a little bit smaller than the other one but we will see that then um, what we can delete is this here we can delete we can this move to the third layer that we can delete that we must build now then that here the spike move on the third layer this complete round stuff there move to the third layer too oh yeah this there okay and this middle um, part here uh, needs a color too that is uh, for sure and it should be a uh, black metal so no silver so we kill the silver here oh no we give them a plus and say here black metal and I think we have black metal glossy better is that yeah black metal glossy we take that and assign it so we have here this black metal glossy that is good uh, 
we can take this plaque, this silver and the wheel itself, shift D. So we have it for the front wheel and we only need here to small that down or up. I think can be maybe a little bit smaller but not much. So we scale that with proportional editing scale a little. That is okay, I think. Good. Then we scale it up that it hits into the black one here. Okay. Here I see there is some rest. So I take that with L and disable proportional and delete that. Good. So we have it from the one side, bring it in the middle, shift D, make a copy of them, then use the apply rotation scale, then the mirror interactive and bring it to the other side. Then think on it, we must rotate in the Y now to get it between them, such like that. And then we bring it into the middle too. And then we get our wheel done. Here we must give them a plaque metal too, and we must join that and that together. Then we take here this circles there and give them plus the black uh, metal glossy and assign that. Good. Now we take a copy of each of these wheels. So complete copy. Shift D and move them to the third layer and border selection that one complete copy shift D and move to the third layer too now we make here all together so we take that 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 and join it plus the middle join and now we have normally one wheel yes the same we make here that one that and that join and the middle join and grabbing yes it's one wheel yes good so we have the wheels um front wheel back wheel and we have to make an instance of that you know that because we now have too many uh, words here so we move them to the six i think it was yeah. So we go here with the 3D cursor to the middle point with Shift C. Then we go to first layer and take our wheel, the front wheel, move it to the sixth layer. We go to the sixth layer. We want to make it in the middle point. So Alt G to bring them in the middle then control G to give a group name and that is front wheel that is done so we go back to the first layer and input it here so add group instance front wheel and we have the instance and can make it across smaller good then the same with the back wheel so move it to the sixth layer go to the sixth layer alt g to bring it in the middle control g to give him group name and that is the back wheel back wheel good then we go back to first layer and place here our instance at group instance the back wheel and make the cross smaller 
So, the wheels are finished. Uh, we have only made this here the middle part there that must we plug in. And then that is the fire safe. Good, I think for today that is okay. What we done? Uh, yeah, next time we have to do some like the, the wheel for the steering and the lights and uh, yeah, the rest there. You see it. Okay, so wish you a wonderful day and see you in the next part of our tutorial. So see you, bye.